Good morning. Good morning, everyone. What is today? We are going to a party of my um, cousins. Mm -hmm. uh, she is turning one <laughs> years old. And who else's birthday is it today? I don't think I've even told her yet. Grandpa Rob. Yeah. So I posted an Instagram of him and Aubrey unintentionally matching. One day I showed up and they were literally wearing the same like color clothes. She a uh, yellow shirt and khakis. And it was so cute. And thank you guys so much for leaving some birthday love on that Instagram post. You guys are so sweet to even do that. But um, I'm not going to see him till later, I think. I don't know if he's working or what. I hope I see him today because I'm getting him a little birthday present. And so first we have to stop and get his birthday present. I'm meeting up with someone for it. Um, you'll see what it is. And then we are going to go to the birthday party. Aubrey's super excited. The twins are napping, so I'm so happy that they're getting a nap in before they go play. Because it's out at... Um, Aunt Susie's property so it's kind of big and they can run around and everything so they'll be if they didn't have a nap they would have been pooped wait mommy um do, does Aunt Susie have like a big park thing she just has a lot of land oh yeah so we are getting ready for that. I have to get the twins up in just a second. So we'll see you at the party, guys. Really fat too. So they, they stay pretty small. These guys are all babies. I'm a pet it. Pet it. Say hi. Do they headbutt each other? The goats. I these guys haven't started that yet, but yeah, they do. <laughs> Hi, Ella. It's like a establishing dominance oh. thing. So oh, the alpha of all the goats we have is actually a female. Oh, oh yeah. No, you don't want to them. Look, there's is that cool? Hey, what's up, dude? Pet him. Hey, I was just calling you. Oh my gosh, you're funny. That, uh, your so you want a bunny, but you won't even touch it. Okay. I want to touch you. Right on. I'm gonna yep. have to run away. Look, there he is again. <laughs> I was on my way. I just didn't want to come all the way out here. I was driving by your house, so I just want to double check. Do you want to pet that one? <laughs> Be gentle. It's not a dog. <laughs> I think someone had a little too much fun at the party. And I got a balloon with this. Happy birthday, Ella. Good morning, everyone. I am getting some things done this morning. That's why I haven't picked up the camera quite yet. I'm just trying to get some laundry done, get some cleaning done, put my kitchen back in order. But I am making my dad some vegan gluten-free chocolate chip cookies right now, and they look pretty good. This is before they go into the oven. So I'm gonna put them in now, and I'll let you guys know what they look like. I have high hopes because I think they're gonna turn out, but I don't know quite yet. I hope so. But my dad is vegan and it's his birth it was his birthday yesterday. I didn't get to see him. But I'm going to go over there today and give him his present and these will be a part of his present. He's very passionate about eating vegan, so I wanted to I like to bake, so I wanted to make something special for him. So if these turn out and you guys want me to do a recipe like bake with me thing, I will. Um the ingredients are really interesting. I've never uh, looked at coconut milk. It looks like lotion, but yeah, it's just interesting. I'm excited to see how they turn out. It looks, the batter looks really good. I mean, it looks just like regular. I don't have beater, so I wasn't able to get the coconut oil like really smushed, but I'm just hoping that they don't like go flat or anything. You know, so that's the true test. So we'll see. Okay, so there's 46 seconds left and I can smell them. I haven't peeked at them because I don't want to. 
I normally turn the oven light on and like watch my stuff bake, but I just want to be surprised and hope that they're not super flat. So it's about to go off in two seconds and then I will see with you guys what they look like. So nervous. They smell delish. Do you smell them, Aubrey? Yeah. Yeah? This morning at 7 a.m., Emma came out to the fridge and was opening it and I came out and she was playing with these little HelloFresh ketchups. I'm like, oh my gosh. Get in bed. There it is. Okay, guys, let's see. Oh, they look good. Yay. Cookies. Oops. Okay. I don't know why this one is always the one that's got that but that's okay oh my gosh i'm so happy so on the thing it says to pop a couple um chocolates on top when they get out so i'm gonna do that Mommy, just for fun what i need for grandpa okay hold on baby aubrey I made grandpa a book so Here, i spelled you, so I, sp it? I spelled ups truck so it spelled so I'm gonna tell you how to Don't spell. Touch. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna show you how to spell UPS truck. So U P S J K. Don't touch, Emma. So that's how you spell UPS truck. Okay, you guys, I can't help myself. I just oh. want to try it. It looks delish. I mean, it looks like a real cookie. So let's try it. Aubrey's gonna taste it with me too. Mm -hmm. Can I taste? Let me try. I don't know. That's, That's really good. I'm scared. Uh oh. Good, huh? Yum. Mm, really chocolatey. Really. I think Grandpa's gonna love them. Mm -hmm. Here, let me get her a napkin. Thumbs up, guys. Let me know if you want the recipe. Look at Papa's bed. Do you like your new sheets, Bubby? Yeah. Are those nice? I love these. But They're I do. nice and clean. Smell them. Oh, that smells like stop. So these are Bubba's new sheets, and I still have to get the curtains and uh, Mommy, the, Mommy, the me? blanket. Can yeah, I'm gonna work on you next, but I gotta get Bubba because he doesn't have much. Huh, so they're just little trees. I love that. And then the curtains that I saw, it's actually the curtains that I saw first and I was like, I'm in love with those. So they're gray, no. Mommy. And they're blackout curtains, so that's a plus, but they're gray with um, the white trees of this. And then I saw these sheets and I was like, that's perfect. And then I'll paint his room like a dark gray. And happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear grandpa. Happy birthday to you. Well, thank you. <clears throat> Come so check fun. it out. We made you chocolate chip cookies with casein and eggs. Ooh. I'm just kidding. They're vegan and gluten free. Ooh, and they're nice. delicious. Wow. Look inside. <laughs> Holy cow! Look at that. Tell Grandpa what's on there. What is so that? So that's you and me, and that's on the computer with you, like, and there's a flower and a heart and a cookie. <laughs> And then UPS truck, and there's some letters. Yeah. Gotta get my UPS truck in there. <laughs> I really this is a oh. present from us, too. And also, this is a present from us. Oh, yeah. I hope it fits, but. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
Do you like it? I like it. What does it say? It says Grandpa, the man, the myth, the legend. You want on there? <laughs> Pretty good. Well, thank you very much. And you have to taste the cookie. Oh, yeah. Aubrey wants to have one with you. Or did you already have one? I already had one. Mm. Like it? Aren't they good? That is the best birthday cookie I have <laughs> ever had in my life. Did you make them? Mm. Yeah, you did. Yeah, my mommy made mm. them. Mm -hmm. They are good. <laughs> Yummy. Not a slobber boy, though. <laughs> okay, you guys. I came to the pharmacy to get my dad's prescription he my parents both actually have walking pneumonia so please have them in your prayers but they should be good they uh, my dad got it er caught it early enough and they are actually going on a trip so that's why they need these antibiotics to kind of get rid of this crud before they get on an airplane so I decided to go to the pharmacy for him it's a win-win because the kids are at home with grandmas, with grandma. I am in the car. It was nice out earlier, but now it's raining, pouring rain. And it's actually really nice, but I wish I was in like my bed at my house listening to the rain because it's so relaxing. Instead, I'm like about to fall asleep in the car because there's a line ahead of me. So that's never fun, but yeah. I feel bad for my dad that on his birthday he's sick, of course, right? <sighs> the sickness won't go away for anybody. We are back his home and I'm Mommy. about to make some dinner. I'm hungry. My parents were eating garden burgers and I was gonna try them but I figured I'd get out of their hair with the twins because my dad um, just really wanted some rest. So I figured I'd get out of their hair let them enjoy dinner together and I'll come home and make my own dang dinner. So I'm going to make some rice, cabbage, carrots and onions and then I'll put sausage in for Ryan's but I'm not going to have any sausage. Okay? Okay, this is what I have. Some uh, carrots, garlic, onions and cabbage. Ryan's sausage and the rice is done. Let's check it out. Ooh, yeah. I hope that it is good. I was holding both of the twins and they didn't want me to let them let them down, but I said, Do you guys want rice? Yeah. Do you want rice? Yeah. Say rice. Yeah. Do you want rice? Yeah. Rice. Rice. Daddy's home. And we are all sitting down to eat dinner at the table, having a good time. Scratch the down. kids like it. I'm eating some rice with sausage. sausage. And Daddy will sit right there. Right. Yeah. Right. Take a bite. Hello. Ready? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.
Okay. So that is all the laundry that I have to deal with tonight. It is like midnight. My friend was just here. And so I don't even know. I'm too tired to do all that. I might just be sleeping underneath clothes. <laughs> Aubrey has to go to school tomorrow. And it's back to the daily grind. Ryan has big news for you guys tomorrow and you guys will see that hopefully um yeah so the fact of the day is that my dad turned 59 and that shocks me my parents seem like they're like in their 20s especially my dad he's just such a hard working guy and you would never know that he was almost 60. Not that 60 is old or anything. I don't think it is. Also, my mom will be 59 in a month. So, I don't even know what this vlog was about, you guys. I am so pooped. But tomorrow will be good. Ryan has tomorrow and Tuesday off. So the vlogs will be way better, I promise. But we'll talk to you guys tomorrow.